stockphotoguru.com featuring Steve Harmon. Hey guys, it's Steve again with stockphotoguru.com and today um, as part of one of our lessons here on actually being able to establish your stock photography business, we're going to show you how to make a portable light box. Uh, that's awesome. We just made another really big one that works pretty well if you want to do larger stuff. Maybe if you want to bring it to an antique store or something like that and just shoot tons of stuff. Um, this is going to be a little more tabletop version using two um, hot shoe flashes that we're going to hook up to um, uh, a really cheap, in inexpensive, uh, Chinese-made uh, kind of like wireless strobe trigger. Uh, and I'll show you those in a second. But um, for now, what we're using here is we're using some Plastex waterproof wall panel. This stuff's great, it's really flexible. One side's a little smoother than the other and you can kind of wipe it down, so it's pretty cool. So anyway, I'm gonna show you guys how to put this together. Uh, for this one, it's it's, a little, it's quite a bit smaller than the other one, but we have this piece left over, so we're using it, which ends up being pretty rad, but we can use all we have. We're kind of like Indians. Uh, these are like two feet, two, we have two, two that are two feet. Uh, four pieces that are about 18 inches, and then uh, two pieces that are about 16. We've got two little uh, four inches and two two inches. We're gonna put this together, and I'm gonna show you what we got. So, all right, so ta-da, it's all together. Um, this one's a little smaller than our big one, but it's kind of cool. Really portable because we kind of interchange the legs. Uh, a little short, or a little 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 short here um, on our crossbars. You can fix it up. Doesn't matter. This fits perfectly onto, onto your pack frame. So, I mean, if you're, if you're begging for change or something, you're like ready to rock, if you're going like, you know, hiking. Anyway, pretty easy. This thing can also, again, roll up into like maybe a yoga thing or something. You are ready for some around town psych photography that can be wiped down very easily. No more wasting that seamless paper. Sometimes plastic is better for America and for you and for stock photo geniuses like yourself. So anyway, Steve, your stock photo guru, along with Stuart Wainstock, and we're going to be inside here in a few minutes showing you how to utilize this thing with some hot shoe flashes. And come on in. Boom. Bam. Shoot that. Both my lights went off. It's a really nice looking photograph. I'll have to show it on the computer later, but um, gave some real nice crispy data even over here like on the uh, some, some nice highlighted edges and stuff. I can easily cut that out too and make that all white around the edge. Got a little bit of shadow coming in here and I can move my lights around really simply to give me some different variations. So this little tight light tent's cool. I can even bring it outside in the middle of uh, uh, a sunny day, wrap my um, my uh, uh, shower curtain over the top so it'll diffuse kind of going down. I don't have to use any lights at all. I can just kind of shoot some stuff outside on a sunny day. So this is a really cheap way. I'd say 30 bucks, something like this. It's a little more. This thing costs about $20 if you want to buy the whole sheet. And I got this huge one over here that we'll, we'll show you kind of how we're going to use that for different things. I can put a whole kid in there. I can put a baby in there. I could put a prisoner in there. Anyhow, so this thing's going to be great.